So Elon Musk's Starlink internet service is finally coming to Africa. This is some great news for the African continent. But before we get into that, if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. And if you do eventually end up liking the video, hit the thumbs up button. So what is Starlink? Starlink is basically a satellite based internet service, more like a VSAT. But the difference is that it operates in low orbit, which means lower latency and higher speeds. So we're talking about 50 to 250 megabits per second for the average user. And if you're a business, you can actually expect to get between 150 to 500 megabits per second. That is fast, faster than probably your local internet service provider. Now, who's getting Starlink in 2023? Zimbabwe alongside 24 other countries will be getting Starlink but they won't be the first. The first countries to get Starlink will be Zambia, Kenya, Mozambique, and Angola. So if your country is getting Starlink in 2023, that means your government and Starlink have already negotiated some form of terms. Now, South Africa was on the waiting list to get Starlink, and it was expected that they would have had it by now, at least in the first quarter of 2023. But now it's indefinite, which means maybe the authorities in South Africa uh, haven't agreed terms with Starlink. So how much will it cost you to get Starlink? For a residential user, you can expect to fork out $599 for the equipment, which includes the satellite and the modem, plus $110 each month for the service. Now, the beauty about Starlink is that it's unlimited. Now, granted, in Africa, that is very expensive. Not many people will be able to afford it. But what that will do is it will bring competition to local service providers. As you know, internet on the continent for the most part is pathetic and local service providers will need to get a run for their money. So here's the full list of all the African countries and when they'll be getting the Starlink internet service. Now, personally, I'm excited about this development and what it will do to the African continent. Imagine how we'll be able to bridge that digital divide between us and the developed countries. Now, I know those will be early adopters, probably will be uh, people will be working in remote areas like resorts, schools or clinics in uh, remote areas. So that's it. That's great news. Elon Musk's internet service is coming to Africa. Finally, finally, finally. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Otherwise, see you in the next video. Thank you.